Welcome back, guys, to another episode of Homefront the Revolution. Hello down there. I'm Dana. And you are Mr. Spy. You and I. We're gonna play a game. You're gonna tell me what the Norks know about us. And I'm gonna hurt you while you do it. This game will be a lot more fun for me than you, I'm afraid. The question is, will it be quick? Or will it be really, really slow? Just scream as loud as you want, okay? No need to suffer in silence. Okay. Nipples. What? Hey, Dana. I hear we got company. Who is he? Oh, uh, just another spy. Can I ask him a few questions? How do you know he's a spy? Well, that's what Baker and Skizari said. Those two? Dana, they're dumb as shit. Do you got anything on them? Say, Doc. Get some ID. What you got here? Ethan Brady. I knew it. Walker's message said he was coming in with this guy. Well, no one told me. Yeah, well, if I could ever find you when I need you. Mm. You'd only just joined Harvey's crew, right? I'm sorry about what happened, but you survived. We could use a guy like you. I'm Jack Paris, by the way. This is Doc Sam Burnett, and, uh, Dana Moore, you met no hard feelings. Right? <laughs> You're a Nipples boy. first! You okay, kid? I'll let you touch him in another way, though. Trauma. Dana. Possible concussion. I got some pills you should take. Hey, Doc, you don't need to open up. He needs to keep his focus. Head injuries can be unpredictable. You feeling confused, kid? Disconnected? He's fine, Doc. You know what's real, don't you, Brady? Looks like he's been through a lot. Last thing he needs is more trouble. Can't you fix him up a new ID and let him go? It's not that easy, Doc. You saw the screens. The Norks want this guy bad. Besides, we need people like him. He ain't afraid to take a chance. And he's seen too much already. Yeah. So, what do you say, Brady? You gonna stick with us, huh? Yes, sir! It ain't gonna be glamorous. And you're probably gonna die. Ah, speeches like that. I'm amazed we haven't won the war already. Yeah, well, that's why we need Walker. Our words ain't my special. So, any objections to Brady joining us? Yeah. No? Sweet. Well, if no one's gonna listen to me, I'll be getting back to my work. Good luck, kid. Go along, Doc. All right. As soon as we get word where they're holding Walker, we gotta find a way to bust them out. Everything depends on him. But first things first, we're gonna get you trained up and show you how we do things around here. I'm heading out. Got that transceiver to take care of. See ya. Walker. All right. Well, it's good you Welcome to the Resistance. Walker must have seen potential in you. Uh, well, if he trusted you, my instincts tell me you're all right. And we need more people like you. People willing to join the uprising. Now, that's what it's all about now. We gotta stir the people up, and soon enough we'll be snowballing. Get the whole city behind us, and the Norks won't stand a chance. Walker's a spark. People will follow him. We gotta get him back. Uh, we've been down here for a few months now. This is all part of the Broad Street subway extension. It was mothballed back in 21 when the city ran out of money. It's not on any of the pre-war maps, so the Norks don't know about it. And here you have it, Brady. This is the boot that's gonna kick the KPA's ass. Come on over here. But first things first, let's get some American steel in your hands. This is uh, Sidney Cook. He runs the armory. Who's this? That's Ethan Brady. He was helping Walker. Walker got arrested. Yeah, but that wasn't Brady's fault. Don't worry about Cookie here. He's a uh, general in a pissed off mood. But he's a genius at improvising weapons, and that's why we keep him around. Ain't that right, Cookie? Always cooking up something. <laughs> Cookie. One day you're gonna make that joke and I'll shoot you dead. Then we'll see who's laughing, huh? Sydney, take it easy, will you? Brady needs a weapon. What can you spare? You're gonna have this. If it turns out you show some aptitude, then we can talk about it. That's all I get? Okay. All right, shot. Now you're thinking a pistol won't do much, but with one of Cookie's special conversion kits, suddenly you got yourself an SMG. Rocket launcher. That's pretty cool. 
Got thrown hack, distractions, explosive, and thin incendiaries, bipods, reflex sights, laser sights, sniper scopes. Come on, Brady, Dude, we got some cool stuff in here. Don't be shy, Brady. Take a kit. Take a kit. Weapons. SMG kit. Boom. There you go. Now try converting your. All right. Press up to customize your weapon, then R1 to change to the SMG conversion. What just happened? There are many like it, but this one is mine. What the? F so we can go back to pistol if we want, or we can go back to S. And That's crazy. All right, I'll take it. Good stuff. Always a charmer. See you around, Sid. Parish, we're still waiting on that transceiver intel. Uh, yeah, yeah, I know. Don't worry about it. More's on it. Say hey to Brady. He's a new recruit. The resistance is more than just frontline troops. It's What's up? People helping the best they can. Take Doc Burnett. He's a good example. Five years ago, I was facing... That's not gonna win this war, though. Top line is, we gotta build up our strength by expanding our red zone operations. We keep ambushing and raiding. That weakens the Norks and strengthens us. Eventually, we'll turn the tables. And in the yellow zones, we're fighting for the hearts and minds of the people trapped there. We give them the belief that we can win. And when Walker gives the call, they'll rise up and follow. We only get one shot, though. We gotta be ready. Okay, I want you to head to the red zone. Dana will teach you how we operate. Out there, she's the best in the business. Just try not to piss her off, huh? Show me I'm right to trust you, okay? Yes, sir! You don't want to go out there unprepared. You should take some Molotovs. Hey, Lorna. Help the new guy out. Be best if you learn how to make your own. Grab some ingredients and give it a try. Okay. So igniter and propellant. Okay. Open the weapon wheel, highlight Molotov, and press R2 to craft it. Okay, incendiary. Improvised chemical defenses. Hold R2. There you go. Nice one. Okay, now you're set. Molotovs are great against their soldiers, but they don't do shit to drones or vehicles. So watch out for those. Elm trees down here. Good luck out there. All right, let's do it. We've got some Molotovs, incendiary devices. Such as Molotovs are effective at taking out groups of infantry. Yes, sir. Weren't Molotovs originally made for taking out tanks? I think that was their original intention um, back in the old days. But uh, obviously, with today's technology, they aren't going to be quite as effective. So. Dana, this is Parrish. I'm sending you Brady. He can help you hit the KPA transceiver. Make sure you get the coordinates of every KPA operation in the area. Dana here. Understood. We'll get you those locations. As soon as we can reach the KPA transceiver, we'll download the data. Shit, Dana. We got a patrol. They must have switched routes overnight. You got any ideas? No time to go around. Let's hit him. All right, here we go, boys. So we're heading up out of the safe zone and outside. Elm tree red zone. Brady, over here. What's up? Okay, Parrish wants you trained, and I guess I owe you for before, so you get to learn from the best. Just try not to screw things up. I got you, girl. We're ambushing this patrol. Brady, best if you go with G-Man. Just do what he says. Try not to die. Come on, buddy, this way. All right, try not to die. I'll see what I can do. It's ambush time, boys. That guy's up on the rooftops. We're coming up this way. Made in Korea, burnt in the USA. I like that. Through the window, then get your head down. They're close. Just hope it works. They're approaching the marker. This is it. They'll be dropping fire barrels on them? Ready on the barrels. Not yet. Wait. Now. There it goes. They didn't. Oh, there's. I was gonna say they didn't blow up. There it is, though. That's what we wanted. Okay. Airship's coming in. We don't have long. Loot the truck. Go, Airship go, coming go. in. Okay. Loot the truck. 
We got it. Seekers! Heal up real quick. Oh shoot. Wow, look at that giant thing, bro. Running to this way? Isaac's team, head for the transceiver. Fire team, regroup on me. That's us, Brady. Come on. All right, I'm going. I'm not sure where I'm going. We're going this way. Let's go, boys. It's hard to believe this thing was a pistol. Converted it to an SMG. It's pretty cool. Where are you guys? Isaac, we hit trouble. Be better if we split up. Everyone head for a transceiver. With luck, some of us will find a way through. Brady, I've uploaded a transceiver location to your phone. We'll try for the others. Good luck. Nice! Hack job! 500 bucks! I'll take it, boys. That's good stuff. Uh, we have a new mission, though, so let's go see if we can uh, journal added strike points. Strike points are key locations for the KPA and so make excellent targets for the resistance. Taking strike points towards KPA tech, or rewards KPA tech, the amount of which varies based on the difficulty of the strike point. Taking strike points contributes to the hearts and minds total in a district. Claimed strike points will often contain useful items such as gunsmith lockers for buying equipment, beds, healing. Cool. Looks good. All right, so the hearts and minds of certain areas, it sounds like... Uh, there are different divisions in this game where we're gonna have to like build up morale and then be able to have people rebel. Press R2 to use the accelerator, L2 to break, right to activate your headlight, and X for the handbrake. Here we go. We are riding out on a motorbike, son. Oh gosh. Oh, baby. Hello. I ain't worried hey, about it. This is Parrish. What's the situation? You reached the transceiver yet? Parrish, we hit trouble. Had to split up. One of us will get there. Don't worry. Okay, I'm counting on you. Where are we supposed to get in here? Oh, I guess we're... That warehouse contains a KPA transceiver. Acquiring access to it may grant us intel about the nearby stronghold and other KPA operations in the zone. Okay. That's good to me. Gonna try to hack this thing fast. Well, that was quick. Westbury Sugar Plant Operations Base has now been established. Good stuff. I kind of like that hacking mechanism. Alright. So we're looking good. Ooh, there's a stash in this warehouse. Brady, it's more. You managed to get to the transceiver. I'm impressed. We'll put that intel to good use. I guess Parrish was right about you. I'm gonna follow up a possible walker sighting. You should familiarize yourself with our operation. We have our main weapon store hidden inside this district. It's run by Ned Sharp. You should head over there. Introduce yourself. I'm uploading the location to your phone now. I'll see you around, Brady. Where is this stash at? It says that the stash is like right here. But I can't... I can't find it. Is it down? Oh. Ooh. Ooh. This is Billy Alpha. All available teams. Listen up. Nice, here it is. We're gonna get him back. Bet your ass we are. I want everybody's eyes and ears wide open. Any word, any sign, any sub micro spec of information about where they've taken him, you report in. Everybody got that? Loud and clear. On it. You got it. All right, Paris just texted us. We need all the intel on Walker we can get our hands on, so keep an eye out for anything that might give us a lead. Morris says, I know you're pretty new to try to avoid KPA patrols. The less they see us, the better. Okay, it's so like when we were on the motorcycle a second ago, probably better to not run right by them. You know what I mean? But uh, it's all right. We'll try to uh, we'll try to keep it chill from now on. 
I think our motorcycle, we left it just right outside here. I'm not seeing it now, so. It's a good guy, right? Yeah. Oh, you can recruit people and dismiss them to come with you? Is there a way to like look for your motorcycle or call your motorcycle or something? You know what I mean? Oh wow, look at that. You can see all the stats of your weapon and put stuff on it. Brady, these strongholds are imposing, but we think we figured out some ways to get inside. We've identified a structural weakness around the large air vents. Put a bomb on that, you can blow open a route. Some people have suggested jumping a bike right over the walls, although I think you'd have to be crazy to try that. Hell yeah, that sounds good to me. seem to suggest some of these places have tunnels leading in, but we've not been able to confirm that. Whatever route you try, it's a tough fight. So make sure you're ready before you take one on, okay? Good luck, Brady. Dude, these little warehouse cache things are fantastic. They give us so much stuff. Alright. I'm not sure how to call our motorcycle or get to our motorcycle. Oh, wait. It says there's a motorcycle like right here. Is it inside this? I think it's inside right here. Oh, we can cut it with our bolt cutters. Nice. Solid. Resistance bikes all have a built-in transponder used to lo locate hidden resistance stashes. Nice. All right, well, we are going to fall out here, boys. KPA are reportedly establishing a new base of operations. We're going to head to our new objective. Liberating this from the Norks. 